Welcome to SAP ERP Quality Management Course. Lecture number two, how to create quantitative or numeric inspection characteristic. Trainer, Mohammed Akib Sheikh, SAP QM Lead. This is lecture number two. Before this, we have learned how to create qualitative or non-numeric inspection characteristic in lecture number one. In lecture number two, we will learn how to create numeric or quantitative inspection characteristic for quality inspection plan. We advise you that before watching this video, please read all the information about relevant fields and terms we described already here. Here you can see the path. Now double click on the transaction code QS21 or type this T code in command bar and press enter key. A new window will be opened, create master inspection characteristic, initial screen. Fill these fields according to your requirement. Choose plant. Master inspection characteristic number or identifier. Enter valid from date. After made entries in these mandatory fields. Press enter key from your keyboard or press enter key icon. A new window will be opened. Create master inspection characteristic general data. Under the control data heading. You will mark check in quantitative check box as we are going to create quantitative or numeric inspection characteristic. If you want to get information about any field that you can select this field and press F1 from your keyboard like this. Under the general information heading, you will set the status as released and choose incomplete copy model. We have described the difference between incomplete copy model and complete copy model in the lecture number 1. Select status field and then press F1 key again to get the information about this field. In short text, you will type inspection characteristic name, for example, weight, length or height as these are the quantitative inspection characteristics. In search field, Copy the name of inspection characteristic from short text field, then paste in the search field. Characters limit for this field is 40 characters. If inspection characteristic name is longer than 40 characters, then you can create long text by clicking on create long text button. You will click on create long text button and here you can maintain long text if inspection characteristic name is longer than 40 characters. Now press enter key from your keyboard. A pop-up window of control indicators will be displayed. Here you can set the control indicators or parameters according to quantitative inspection characteristic or as per your quality inspection requirement. You can see a little difference in the control indicators or parameters as compared to qualitative or non-numeric inspection characteristic. You can see here that there is no characteristic attribute field available here instead of this field some new fields, lower specific limit, upper specific limit and target value etc. are available here. This is because that we are going to create quantitative or numeric inspection characteristic, so control indicators are changed for some fields. We will mark check in sampling procedure checkbox. Under the results confirmation heading, you can choose summarized recording or single result recording. If you want to record results in multiple values, then you will mark check on single result recording parameter. 
If you record result in single or average value, then you will mark check on summarized result recording checkbox. Select the field and press F1 key from your keyboard and read the detailed information about these field. Now mark check in required characteristic field. Then click on continue button or press enter key from your keyboard. You can see here some checks have already been marked by default. There is no need to change it and then press continue button again. These control indicators or parameters set up are exemplary. You can set these control indicators according to your quality inspection requirement. Then click on save icon to save the quantitative inspection characteristic. You have done it. Thank you. This is the end of lecture number 2. Lecture number 3 is about how to create codes and code group.